Hey, what's up everyone? This is Jim Labuda here once again. And today we are gonna do something special. We are looking at the golf swing of Rose Zhang. Now, Rose is your 2022 and 2023 NCAA Division I champion. She competed and won the 2020 US Women's Amateur. And she was also victorious in the 2023 Augusta National Women's Amateur. Now, she was making her professional debut in the Mizuho Americans Open on the LPGA Tour this weekend. We're going to go ahead and take a look at her golf swing and see exactly what she does to create a ton of club head speed that is very, very rare in the golf world today that only one other player does. So if we take a look at her golf swing now, we're going to look at her setup. Her setup here, legs are a little bit more upright than normal. We normally don't see this kind of straight lay. You want to see a little bit more knee bend in the golf swing. But again, she's in a really good position here. Overall, she looks very relaxed in the setup. There's not a lot of tension in her golf swing. As she starts to take the golf club away, we're going to see that left leg starts to turn back a little bit. She gets here where the club's parallel to the ground. We're going to look and see that the club face on this driver parallel to her spine. Really, really good. Very, very square position. As she gets to the top of the golf swing here, again, creates a lot of separation between the upper and lower body. Main thing we want to see, though, is as we look, club head gets a little bit more behind her here. We can see that the grip end of the club, typically we want to see this over your ankle, the center of your ankle, but you can definitely see this is a little bit more behind her at this point. Even though right now the golf club the left arm a little bit more above that shoulder. She's a little bit more of an upright golf swing. But let's look at her downswing and see where she creates all this tremendous club head speed. As she starts moving into the downswing, you're going to see a little bit of a rerouting of the club there. But this is the move that we want to focus on. And really, we just want to put a circle around her hips here, or a square. We're going to put a square around her hips and watch what these hips do. As she gets an impact... I want you to see as she starts moving here, we're going to slowly move it frame by frame, but this is where the major, major club head movement comes in. She gets an impact and watch what happens right here. Look at that. If you watch that scorecard holder in her right pocket, you can see how that right glute muscle, her hip is actually moving backward in the golf swing. The only other person that golfs that does this on the PGA Tour is Rory McIlroy, and because he is using his right side as a break, exactly what Rose is doing here, they're using their right side as a break to actually release the club behind them. The only way they can do this is by having a ton of core strength and core power to release that golf club and actually let those hips move backwards in the golf swing. That is because of your oblique muscle that runs diagonally across your abdominal, your abdomen from the top of your left oblique down to the bottom of your right because of the contracting of that muscle. That is actually what's moving that hip backwards. Again, Rose Zhang right here, Rory McElroy, very, very similar golf swings. Will they have the same Hall of Fame careers? I predict big things for Rose Zhang going forward. This is a very, very strong, very, very good golf swing. And I think you're going to hear a lot from Rose Zhang in her professional golf career.